guys it's me again Des and in this short video I'm going to give you dating advice if you are a foreign man dating a Filipina so please don't hesitate to share this to your friends as well and have a, a successful date with a Filipina so I have more than 10 advice here or tips that maybe you should remember or can be useful to have a successful date Number one, dress simple, but comfortable for you. Filipinas know that majority of the foreign men are very tall and your stature is already intimidating for us. So it's important for us to feel comfortable during the dates or during our first date. Please don't wear something that you would look like going to attend Golden Globe Awards or Emmy Awards night and also you don't need to wear too many jewelries to impress us next one don't bath yourself with a strong cologne come on guys whether it's 500 peso cologne or 10,000 peso cologne it doesn't matter because if you smell too strong for us, then we might end up our date in a hospital ward or I might be needing an oxygen tank next to me while talking to you. Please understand if we bring someone on our first date. Some Filipinas may feel uncomfortable or uneasy because this is going to be their first time to date a foreign man. Please keep your opinion, anything about Philippines to yourself. This is not, you are not allowed to say something, but the thing is you are a foreign visitor. And Filipinos have very strong beliefs in our culture, tradition, and we get offended easily if you comment about our way of life. We don't want our day to end up in a prison cell or talking to a police officer. The next one is, please ask first if you want to know more about our family or past. This is to avoid misunderstanding if you are dating a young or maybe a shy type of Filipina or someone who is a little bit immature and also we don't want you to be too straightforward about asking and we will do the same thing the next one is Please don't say why not read English books or watch English movies than watching Korean drama. Guys, whether you don't mean to offend, but you know, you know, some Filipinas may take it in a wrong way because this can be an indirect way of telling us that your English is bad, you need to improve your English because I don't understand you. And it's like telling us Korean drama it's not really good at all the next one business stocks sports and politics are not our favorite subjects of course not all Filipina but if you are dating a Filipina who who haven't finished schooling or all she knows is just TikTok or just watching TV you know it's not really bad at all but the thing is if you are looking for someone who can discuss these things then you have to get someone who is a cum laude in college or someone who is from high society the next one learn few local or casual words or a little bit about our culture Guys, you don't have to memorize our local Shakespeare poetry or a 500-page Philippine history book just to impress us. 
you know, just learn a few greetings or short words or phrases, and that can be really useful in our conversation. Be yourself. Don't try to be funny if you are not. Guys, you don't have to make yourself look funny or fool just to make us laugh. You know, sometimes it may take a few minutes for a Filipina to, to get to know you or to feel comfortable with you, especially if it is her first time to date a foreign man. The next one, please don't throw dirty jokes first. Guys, not all Filipinas can take or understand or give you dirty jokes too so you have to date her more or let her talk first or you know let's see if she can give you the dirty jokes first because if you if you would do this your Filipina date might feel that you are a pervert or someone very sexual or just interested in, in sex The next one, don't give us money after our date. Guys, never ever do this to a Filipina after the date because this is something very offensive. It's like telling us that thank you for your time or even telling us that we are a hooker. So if you are looking for a Filipina who is into serious relationship and your date is one and she's not into games, this can be an offensive move for you. So don't ever give us money because that is something like you're just paying for our time to be with you. You know, maybe you can give us something for taxi fare and that's not really bad at all. Hi guys, thank you for watching this short video. I really put effort, time, and my energy on this one. So if you have learned something and you appreciate the effort that I gave, you can give tips or donations to me. Just send it to my PayPal link and there you go. So thank you guys for watching all my live stream replays and short videos. Thank you for the support to my channel too. See you soon!